12 companion plants for tomatoes. Worldwide popular, tasty and juicy tomatoes are annual plants from the Solanacea family, easily grown in gardens, fields, greenhouses, and even in larger containers on balconies. And while the process from sowing to harvesting the fruits is not demanding, bad weather, various diseases, and pests can significantly reduce tomato yield. Therefore, various chemical agents have become an almost common practice in cultivating tomatoes. No doubt such treatments are highly effective, but the big question is how many chemical and biological pollutants these synthetic toxins introduce into the plant and fruit, and thus indirectly into the human body. Fortunately, chemical measures are not your only option. You can naturally achieve the same effect by planting suitable plants with tomatoes. And if you want to discover which 12 tomato companion plants will protect it from pests and diseases, increase its yield, and improve its taste, keep watching. Welcome to the channel. In today's video, we will look at 12 perfect companion plants to tomatoes. But before I continue, please tap the like button as it helps the channel. Marigold. Few plants on this list look as enchanting and are as beneficial for tomatoes as marigolds. Marigolds are great ornamental plants that owe their attractiveness to the yellow, orange, red, gold, and mahogany flower heads. But more importantly, they protect tomatoes from root knot nematodes, repel some of the worst tomato pests such as aphids and tomato hornworms by releasing a gaseous substance called limonene and improve soil health. And as a bonus, some of the marigold varieties are edible. Carrot. Carrot is another edible plant that goes well when planted with the love apple. Carrots facilitate bigger and faster growth since they are very good at aerating the soil. Tomatoes grown next to carrots also tend to be more flavorful. Since carrot is a root vegetable, many people don't like pairing the two, fearing that they may end up fighting for the same real estate and not growing as big as they could. But the trick is to give them air to breathe by not planting them close to each other. Basil. Tomato and basil go well together on the plate and in the garden. Can you say caprese salad? The herb from the mint family is one of the world's most famous natural insect repellers that drives away pests with its characteristic scent, which comes from a compound called eugenol. Basil also strengthens the tomato's resistance to diseases and increases the yield. Garlic. Garlic is another world-famous repellent against harmful insecticides though its distinctive odor comes courtesy of allicin, an active organosulfur compound. Planting garlic with tomatoes will protect them from late blight and various pests, such as leafhoppers, whiteflies, and mites, and make them more flavorful. The best effect is achieved when they are grown at a distance of 20 inches, on adjacent beds, or in alternating order in the same bed. Crimson Clover if you're looking for a plant that will slow down soil erosion, improve soil structure, and increase the amount of nitrogen and organic matter in the soil's upper levels, crimson clover is one of the best options. In addition to all the above, this cover crop is excellent in suppressing weeds and attracting pollinators to tomatoes. Borage. Borage is a plant that flies under the radar despite its many possible applications and undisputed benefits. Many of them are out of the scope of this article, but what isn't is its flavor-enhancing and growth-boosting effect on tomatoes. It has the same effect on strawberries. Additionally, this cold-resistant plant attracts bees, even during cold weather, and deters tomato hornworms. Time. If we couldn't sell you on the idea of growing borage and tomato together because you're looking for a more prominent household name but with similar effects, Thyme is the way to go. This fragrant herb is excellent at amplifying tomato flavor, such as armyworm moths, tomato hornworms, and aphids, and attracting pollinators. Due to the lack of size, it can double as a living mulch. This is also true for borage. Amaranth. Amaranth is another great neighbor that won't steal water or space from tomatoes and will serve as their defender. The ancient pseudo-cereal that, if grown next to tomatoes, will be the host for beetles, beneficial insects that like to prey on pests bothering tomatoes. Parsley. Parsley and tomato are the second pair of plants from this list that can coexist in the kitchen and the garden. 
If you grow parsley with tomatoes, you will not only have a delicious herb to add to tomato dishes, but you will also protect tomatoes from many tiny menaces because parsley is known for attracting ladybugs, an insect whose favorite food is aphids and hornworm larvae, and hoverflies, another insect that likes to munch on aphids. Lavender. Bees and other pollinators are vital to a healthy environment and economy that help plants grow, reproduce, and produce food by pollinating them. Which plant is one of the best pollinator attractors? In addition, lavender's recognizable odor, which most people find pleasant, is unappealing and repelling to many pests, which means fewer unwanted visitors for your tomatoes. Asparagus. The best relationships are those in which both parties feel they are getting something out of it. This is precisely the relationship between asparagus and tomatoes if you plant them together. Tomato is a well-known companion plant for asparagus because it produces a colorless alkaloid called solanine that repels asparagus's arch enemy, the asparagus beetle. On the other hand, asparagus defends tomatoes against tubular-shaped nematodes known for feeding off the nutrients in the tomato roots. Calendula. Calendula is the second plant from the Asteraceae family on this list that, in addition to looking beautiful, will naturally repel harmful insects such as greenhouse whiteflies, hornworms, and aphids. The strong scent of calendula flowers can deter pests like nematodes, which can damage tomato roots, leading to healthier tomato plants overall. So there you have it, 12 great companion plants for tomatoes. Some have overlapping benefits, meaning you only need to choose a few to build a bulletproof tomato garden. But even if you opt for only one, there's no doubt you'll get a better version of your tomatoes. I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment below about other plants you would add to the list. Be sure to like and subscribe. And remember that life is better when you garden.